Hi everybody, welcome to another edition of Yo On The Go. Today we're going to be talking about psychometrics. Now what's psychometrics? Psycho means uh, um, uh, psychological and metrics means to measure. So it's a really a measure of your psychological profile. Now you may have heard of uh, main, many different types of styles like DISC uh, or MBTI. I'm going to focus on MBTI which is your Myers-Briggs typology. Myers-Briggs takes a personality and breaks it down to really four categories of which there are two different uh, uh, options. One starts with your extroversion versus your introversion. The other one is your um, intuition versus your sensing of an environment. Uh, and then whether uh, a feeling versus um, thinking. And the last one is whether you're perceiving versus judging. These four different categories and the different typologies give you a combination uh, that result in about 16 different personalities, which for the most part describe pretty much everybody on the planet. That's really the supposition, whether it works or not, uh, I encourage you to look into it and research it, particularly because it gives you a better self-awareness. And that's one thing that I've heard time and time again from leaders, is that their, their success has been dependent on them having an acute sense of self-awareness. Because if you think about it, if you're aware of yourself, you're going to know your strengths and your weaknesses and how to apply that uh, at the best uh, possible moments. So uh, having a strong self-awareness is important. It's also applicable to understand other people. And as you, uh, as you may know, Sun Tzu, Art of War, says if you understand yourself, you'll win half the time. But if you understand yourself and your opponent, you will win 100% of the time. So I encourage you to think about uh, understanding yourself through psychometrics like MBTI or DISC and uh, gain a better self-awareness of who you are. So with that, uh, have a great day and we'll talk to you later. Bye-bye.